Hey guys, Cal here, bringing you another video. This is week four of rushing to Town Hall 15. Uh, we have decided to do Town Hall 15 based on the poll I put out. It seems that uh, at least half of you want it to go all the way to 15. So that's what we're going to be doing. It seems like another chunk of you wanted Town Hall 13. And because of that, I might push a Town Hall 12 to 13 so we can get that Town Hall 13 content people want. And uh, there was a little bit for 14, so we might push our 13 to 14 to get that type of content. So we are going to accommodate everyone here on the channel um, as we do have content for all the Town Halls I pulled. Maybe I'll make another poll to see what other... Um, town halls people would like to see but right now it seems that 12 13 14 15 is probably the most popular unless i'm mistaken but let's just get back into this video we've dropped all defenses we're waiting on resources of course we're at 1400 not 14,000 1400 uh gems so we're about 600 away We've been selling our magic items as we get them. To get there a little bit quicker, we might have to do... Um, where would that be? There's like events. It seems like it's not loading. Oh, Let's see. I don't know where you check that out. Well, we won't, we won't do that right now. Oh wait, it's right here. Never mind, it's not. <laughs> um, there are some like events that you can do to get some extra gems. Which is cool, so we might be doing that. But for now, let's get to the progress. We got everything down. We need now just gold to get our town hall, which is currently going to four, and then it will go to five, and then we'll be done going to town hall 13, it looks like. But to make sure that we're not falling too far behind, I'm upgrading these army camps. I'm not going to be upgrading... Uh, anything past the town hall for example uh, if I need to upgrade this again right but it's between this or town hall upgrade I'm going to choose a town hall upgrade above it but I'm making sure that we at the very least have our fruits and vegetables you know we're making sure our lab is always down it's pretty much always down because it's like equivalent to a town hall pretty much every single time the town hall being five levels has really helped us get um a lot of the important buildings done like these army camps but it is getting quite difficult to farm with these dragons and we'll go straight into it here it feels like they're just outclassed right now it seems that electro dragons are kind of just better and i was not upgrading my barracks like i should have been so we do not have the electro dragon quite yet and uh, because of that, I think we are going to be upgrading that uh, next in line. Of course, once that town hall gets upgraded or finished, finishes its current upgrade, we're going to drop it again right away. But once one of those like other buildings, let's say a... Um, oh, nice. Uh, let's say... An army camp or the lab goes down we'll then switch to the barracks here hmm let's see because like with electro dragons this is like pretty simple they're all touching everything but with dragons ooh, we don't take these out of three we'll take it out of four okay but with dragons it seems like we kind of have to pick and choose what we want there's a fly in my face. Uh, you have to kind of pick and choose. And it seems like it is a little bit difficult. So. You have to be a little bit more picky on what you're doing. Here we do have the eagle popping off. But unfortunately. Uh, we don't have a warden ability. So we just kind of have to pray that we can get through this uh there's something pushing us back let's zap that out and we're just going to keep on going like the dragons do get through 
Um, and it looks like it's not too bad right now, but it has been feeling a bit lacking. But maybe the power of recording the video is is helping us out here. And we're about closed up here. Yep, and then that's going to be it. So we did get a nice 800k. And I was talking about this in yesterday's video. If you haven't seen it, be sure to look at the Town Hall 8 progress video. Uh, four weeks at Town Hall 8. But I was talking about the difficulty of farming. And it seems like as long as you're... Like, pushed accounts feel like they're easier to find loot. Like, here we found a 700k gold, which we're looking for. Raid. And we searched for so long and had to kind of deal with a 200 k -er at Town Hall 8. But to be fair, you don't need as much loot. But it was a little frustrating trying to find loot up there. Um, It looks like if we come from this side... It should be fine. I'm actually just going to not do any zaps here. Because we have these air defenses on the outside. So I'm just going to do a little funneling and then kind of send ourselves along this side. And the reason why I'm doing this is because most of the loot is in the collectors in this first area. So instead of zapping out air defenses, I can zap out the loot I want, as I'm not too worried about the trophies. Uh, right now, this feels like a nice sweet spot I'm in, so I'm not in any rush to really push higher or drop any much lower. So just getting a 50% here and there is all I'm really going for. And the dragons on these dead bases seem to be doing a pretty good job. We aren't going to be able to take out this town hall, I don't think, especially with that sweeper. But it looks like a lot of the loot is mostly in these collectors here, so... Missing out on the town hall has no real uh, down downside for us. King is, of course, taking tons of damage because he's only level 6. The queen taking her sweet time to take out this collector. Let's go queen. And just like that, we got all the loot. I'm going to zap out these collectors. And boom. And just like that, we got all the loot. No need to zap out air defenses. It's one of the big things I like about zaps. And I'm starting to use them in Electro Dragons. I'll be bringing a video on that. The difference between Rage and Lightning. So, of course, <laughs> uh, be, uh, stay tuned for that. But, yeah, this is pretty much what we're doing here. We're just zap dragon farming. Uh, I'm, ta I'm having a very easy time keeping my storages full. To be fair, my storages aren't maxed out. We're quite behind. But, based on progress, the need for maxed out storages isn't quite there and even on my other town hall 12s and 13s i still need to upgrade the storages even though my heroes are maxed and my walls are near maxed so storages are not really a priority in my book of course if you don't log on or no if you're if you do all your farming in one sitting let's say you really want to max out every time you come on so that you can get as many upgrades when your like buildings go down then of course the storage matters but if you're in no rush and uh, you just kind of make sure that you have enough for when they come up you don't over farm it seems that having these max out storages doesn't matter too much uh we do need to upgrade a clan castle but that will come later for upgrades, it seems like we do want... The top priority right now is... Where are you? Is our barrack? There it is. Top priority is here. It looks like we need to upgrade it one, two, three, four more times to get to Electro Dragons. Um, 
uh, in the lab, our priority is the lightning spell. Uh, I didn't have enough loot for the lightning spell at the time, so I dropped this poison spell. And this is another reason why having a big storage is nice, because I wasn't able to use my raid medals to get the elixir I needed to kind of get it in a pinch. And I think this trader really helps, uh, especially in the low town halls. If you have raid medals and nothing to spend it on, it just saves you so much time because, what, 2.5 mil is equivalent to like 5, 5k raid, 500k raids, and uh, those, that saves you a lot of time, so, of course you only get it once a week, but as long as you use it wisely, uh, it is really beneficial, so, hopefully you all did enjoy the video, and I'll catch you on the next one, peace.